saw the uh, Ozo Forge turn up. Um, I think it might be worth it. It's, it you, you gotta weld it up yourself. Uh, the pipe comes. The only bit of welding you gotta do is you gotta weld the flange to the the blower pipe, which then connects onto the plate, and then you screw that on top of it. Um, and then you've got to weld this little jimmy by here to the bottom for your clinker thing. <laughs> um, I got a. I bought this bad boy on uh, Facebook Marketplace for uh, 15 quid. It's a um, British Alcosa. I've got a slight feeling it's not going to be powerful enough, but we can only find that out when um, when it's all together, really. And then I bought this piece of exhaust flexible tubing for, uh, it was a bit pricey, about 25 quid. I got about half a metre of it here. But it just so happens that it connects perfectly into the hole of my blower, and then it fits even more perfectly onto the bottom of the forge so um weld it up and see what happens i've got a slight uh suspicion that the fire pot might not work i don't know i've never dealt with underblower forges i've learned on side blowing forges so we'll see but i think the old thing um the forge was about 100 quid it is pricey i mean you know you could it is more than possible to uh even if you don't have a welder to uh, make yourself a forge for next to nothing really i just had some money in my pocket and i thought bugger it <laughs> i'm gonna buy one it's not like me but yeah 100 quid and then the blower was 15 and then the pipe was 25 so that's you know 150 quid, something like that. I'm not very good with maths. Right, let's get welded up and uh, see what she does. So, it's been about a month since I started the first bit of this video. I've been um, busy with real work. I never get to my hobbies, really. <laughs> um, but I'm pleased with my progress. I found this little box section in the skip uh, in my workplace. I asked for it. You know, so don't worry, I didn't steal it. Uh, and it just so happens that it's absolutely perfect for I was after these. My forge is outside of this building and down there, right? So I've I've built up brick plinths off the floor, which these are replicating. And then hopefully I can just take this outside and then just plonk it on top. Uh, and then I've just fastened the blower to that. And then i got enough pipe in there to... Go to the forge. So it's all going good. All I gotta worry about now is putting the the hood on top and then the chimney through the roof. Which is like a you know a job on its own, but we'll get to that. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to that one. Uh yeah, but all cool. I'm sorry it's not like a it's not a set way of doing things, it never is, you know, in this kind of stuff. Um you know I found this bit of metal in the skip. You won't find another one like it, you know, unless you're really lucky or you make one yourself. You know, it, that's the, just the nature of the beast with this kind of stuff. Especially if you're not willing to pay the money, you know what I mean? you just got to be like a a dumpster diver, you know, like a raccoon. Just find stuff and make it work. Just always be on the lookout for stuff, you know what I mean? And just ask the fellas and or, or women that work there and, uh, you know, they, they'll give it to you nine times out of ten. So, yeah. Cool. Right. Hopefully the next bit of this video will be when I fired it up. <laughs> so it's been months since that last bit of the video I did. Uh, with weekends toiling away and whatever, but um, it's the finished product. Over the moon I am. Got me anvil inset into the floor. I've built this entire thing from scratch, this whole building. I've been doing it for years. <laughs> um, got the hood on i had this this hood was bigger originally i had this for my old forge I, I had when i was a teenager but i just cut the top off it 
and it just goes out the hole then. Uh, make these brackets up pretty easy. And this is it. The the blower's a bit loud, but I'm going to have to find a way to quiet it down. But definitely get stuff up the temperature. I, I've melted a piece of 20 by 20 mil um, bar in here just, just, just now. So, just a few minutes. Goodbye, Gasforge. <laughs> Sweet.